All right, we're asked to find the number of diagonals for a polygon. It's a strange one, it has 15 sides. Um, the number of diagonals, D, is given by this formula. Okay, so they've told us that um, the variable N refers to the number of sides, okay, and this has 15 sides. So I'm going to plug in a 15 wherever there's an N. And then I'm going to solve for D. All right, so let's see. We have, let's slide this up just a little. Our original formula, D equals 1 half. Plug in a 15 right here. And you have your parentheses, very important, uh, minus 3. And the other 15 is sitting right here. OK? Uh, there's a lot going on here, so we're going to clean up this side of the equation. This is an expression, one side of the equation. OK. Um, take care of what's inside parentheses first. 15 negative 3 yields 12. Um, boy, how to say this. 1 half times 15. Well, let me see. This can be written as 15 over 1. So if I multiply these, I'll have 15 over 2, right? 1 times 15, 2 times 1, 15 over 2. And let's see. I'm told I'm supposed to multiply because this set of parentheses is here. I'm supposed to multiply this times the result, OK? So that shows that I'm going to multiply, all right? Instead of putting parentheses here, I'd rather just have a dot. Um, and for 12, if I have a, a fraction I'm multiplying, I really like a fraction next to a fraction. I can just put my 12 over 1. Sorry about that. Um, you can always put a number over 1. And we could reduce a little before we multiply. Well, I can't really fit it all on. All right, so 2 goes into 2 once, 2 goes into 12, 6 times. 15 times 6 is 60, 70, 80, 90. So we have, I guess I'll slide down some more. D equals 90. So if you have a polygon with 15 sides, there are 90 diagonals.